Dad's Nuts and welcome to Dad's Review Channel. For this video I'm reviewing the Bulls Mensar Soljevic Darts and these are the black edition and these are the 23 gram version. You can also get them in 21 gram and 25 gram and the 90% tungsten and these retail for around about 65 euros which is about 59 pound around about 76 dollars. So let's check them out. So as you can see the darts come in a slimline cardboard box and inside there's a little plastic section holding the uh, contents and they come supplied with the um, plastic corn case uh, I have said before it's a neat little case but it only holds the uh, one set of darts and they're also supplied with a set of what look to be medium grip SL stems kind of like a shiny nylon and you've got these signature bulls uh, mensor flights which are in the kite shape the data fit with a fairly short silver point and it's almost a straight bar but if you look closely you can see it's tapered very similar to the Barney style from a few years back and it's got this kind of thin ring grip but it's got a kind of a micro style groove on the top of the rings very neatly machined uh, I wouldn't say it's overly grippy probably about medium to just about high medium uh, got a nice feel there at the front and obviously it's got a smooth section there and then the grip continues along and it gets to a little bit wider section at the rear so depending where you're going to grip it if you're a middle gripper you might be on that smooth section so maybe not so good but for front and rear grippers and I think for rear grippers it kind of feels comfortable there but feels good there for me as a front gripper and coating on the barrel is nice and black some of them sometimes look a bit grey or like a charcoal -y colour but this is quite a deep colour so very neatly machined and coated and then you've got your grip SL stems and these Mensor signature kite shape flights so I'll let you have a close look at it The darts are fitted with a 25mm silver point, it's got a tapered nose with a small section of micro grip that's 3.6mm then you've got this thin coat ring grip which got the micro uh, grip on top of the rings that's 16mm wide and then you've got a smooth section around the middle with the logo that's 10mm wide and then the barrel starts to taper towards the end and you've got more of the thin coat ring grip with the micro grooves on it that's 17.4 millimeters wide and then a section at the end of micro grip which is 3 millimeters wide the length is 50.1 millimeters and the width is 6.6 .6 millimeters that one is 23.07 grams 23.09 grams and 23.11 grams and the weight of the full setup is 24.83 grams with nothing attached the balance of the barrel is towards the front and with the supplied setup it moves a little behind the center point and this is the balance with medium in between short extra short stems and standard flights Uh, got a little bit of fish 
tail and on uh, one of them, but the other two are fairly smooth. The only thing that is put me off a little bit is the point feels quite short. Um, my fingers are slipping off, so I'm not quite getting the right control because it, it's good just doing that a little bit on the end. third anyway but um, grip itself it's not I wouldn't say it's super aggressive or anything but there's a little bit of bite to it and it's got that kind of like subtle kind of feel to the grip so if you need plenty of grip it might not be enough for you but for people who are not too bothered about grip I think it's uh, just a nice enough feel just so you've got enough control on it but I'm going to try the middle now so I'm mostly on the smooth part and a little bit on the grip behind that. Uh, didn't really see a lot of spin from there. And it kind of looped up a little bit. Slightly better balance there, but usually is on a straight barrel anyway, around the middle. Now, I haven't measured these darts yet. I know the dimensions have already been displayed, but I haven't measured them myself. But it kind of feels to me like it's gone a little bit thinner around the middle. So whether the dart is slightly tapered, I think it might be actually. Because it does feel a little bit thinner on the rear, but uh, not too bad from the middle. But like I said, it's got that smooth band there, so not a massive amount of grip. So I'm going to try the rear now. I think it definitely feels thinner on the rear though. Now, I'm not a natural rear grip as you know, but... Uh, it kind of has like a loopy flight path from the rear, so I'm not sure how Mensar Solivit grips it, I haven't checked to be honest. But it feels as if it could be a nice one for rear grippers. Hello, that's the Bulls Mensor Solyovic darts. Um, it's not a bad dart for a front gripper, I don't think. Uh, it's a nice subtle grip, ring grip on it. Not too aggressive, uh, but not so smooth that you don't have something to grip onto. But maybe not as much grip as what some people like. But uh, I can get away with that easy enough. Um, like I say, I think it's definitely thicker on the front, but I haven't measured them yet, but I'm pretty certain it is. It's a little bit difficult for me to tell because I've got astigmatism, so, but it just feels a bit thicker there. Um, so definitely a slightly front-weighted kind of barrel, but 
I think it flew quite nice from the middle and not too bad from the rear as well so if you're a middle or rear gripper it might be a very nice start as well but on the middle it's got that smooth section so it depends on whether you need a, a fair amount of grip or just a little bit of grip but the only thing that uh, put me off a little bit was the point is quite short so I like to rest that finger on the point and it wasn't uh, quite long enough so I felt as if I wasn't getting enough control so that's probably the only thing I would change but I'm going to play with them a little bit more anyway and I'm going to put some standard fights on which is my normal setup I have a feeling that they may be flying smoother with some standards on but very nicely uh, made dart from bulls and the coating on the barrel is very nice um, I do have quite a liking for gold and black coated darts I think gold ones always look nice but black ones always kind of have like a sleek look to them I know a lot of people don't like coated barrels but I can understand that as well because when, when they start to wear they don't look so good but uh, when they're new it is quite a nice look but obviously every coating wears but that's a nice start again from Bulls. So that's the end of the review. Thanks for watching.